Okay, welcome to part seven. Uh, first thing I want to show you is really, really simple, and that is when you want to return your 3D cursor to the origin. It's just a, a shortcut, but I have wanted to do this, you know, many, many times, and I usually end up zooming way in, going like this, and then say cursor to grid to snap it. And that's just stupid. So what you can actually do is just go shift C and then your cursor is at the origin. Beautiful. All right, uh, next thing I want to show you is um, linkage. Uh, I guess this is also one of those pretty obvious things, but I didn't know it. It's uh, kind of convenient. I mean, you probably find multiple cases where you want to use this. Let's just say, for example, I've got you know, a camera with a very specific, uh, you know, lens size, and I want this camera and this camera to both have that lens size. What you can do is select the two, select it to active, hit control L, make links to object data, and bam. Now they're all linked and uh, have the same attributes. You can do the same thing here and uh, for some reason, I didn't know how to do that. It's very quite. It's it's quite useful. Uh, now, what I want to do is um, show you. Hmm. Hmm. My drive is not mounted, so this will wait for the next uh, Blender Tips with Colin Levy. 